Hey, looks like Kondo and the others have turned over a new leaf. They're doing a fine job now, sorting out the regiments. It's incredible how many skilled fighters we've managed to assemble. Now it's up to me to figure out how best to make use of them. Anyways, it's about time we set out for Kyoto. Are you ready? Then let's get going. Bound for Kyoto to protect the Shogun, the Roshigumi leaves Edo, its ranks swelled by a full complement of fierce fighters. Meanwhile, the anti-Shogunate forces also depart Edo for the capital, looking to steal a march on their mortal enemy. I'm afraid we ain't hugging! How dare you demand a toll? The Choshu clan has urgent business with the Imperial Court. Let us part! We couldn't care less what business you have. If you want to go to Kyoto, you'll have to cough a little something up first. I'm right, I know much for our boys combined, eh? <laughs> Wait till the nobles try to get through here. We're about to be rich. <laughs> Have you heard? Seems a bunch of ruffians have taken over the checkpoint. They'll let folks pass in the evening, but not without paying first. We could try to force our way through, of course, but there's a lot of them. We'd risk losing good men. I heard Genzui and his men have made it to the Ejuri post, too. This could be the perfect chance. Listen! The men from Choshu are at the checkpoint as we speak. What say we team up with them and take on those thugs? What? Choshu, you say? The ones plotting against His Excellency? Exactly. If they get wiped out too, we kill two birds with one stone. Huh. Not bad. I'll go and brush the idea. You'd best come with me. What can I say? I'm a genius, right? Got it in one. It's like you can read my mind. This is going to work. You'll see. So it's you, is it? It's been a while? Come on, tell me what you're up to. Well, to cut a long story short, we've joined the Roshigomi. But we're stuck here, thanks to those ruffians. I get the feeling we're all facing the same problem. So, how about we team up and teach them a lesson? Kiyokawa, head of the Roshigomi at your service. You must be Kogoro Katsura. Master of the Shinto Munendu, your reputation precedes you. I would gladly join forces with you. Ah, oh, so you are Hachiro Kyokawa of the Hokushin Ittoryu. But you can't expect me to work with the Shogun's men. Ah, don't be so petty. We're in the same boat. We need all hands on deck.
Exactly. What's the sense in all of us drowning? All right, I hear you. And no, I don't have any better ideas. The last thing I want is to lose men here. Listen, go and round up Shinsoku and Genzui, will you? I wouldn't want to go into battle without them. Shinsoku said he planned to do some sniffing around the local gambling den. And Genzui just had it out himself. We don't want the thugs getting suspicious. This is a job that demands discretion, and that makes you the perfect fit. And worst case, if those two aren't interested in joining us, we all just need to fight this battle with our current numbers. You petty thugs, trying to profit from our nation's crisis. Let us pass, or we force our way through. Well, you certainly talk big. I know your type. Happy to risk the lives of your men. Sure to end up dying before your time. Ah, so you're here too. You can see how things stand. What's our move? You're right, of course. I'll read this to you too. Show this fellow how hospitable we could be. I will take care of you. Don't you worry. Kusaka, are these gentlemen bothering you? What say we deal with them together? I can Ready. do this alone. I don't need help from the road to me. Let's just deal with them first. The checkpoint can be gathered more heads. Who the hell is it? That's that, right? Kasaka. Okita was it. You have some skill. What were you thinking, facing them alone? Seems he was right about one thing. You're out to die before your time. I don't want my comrades sullying their blaze on the likes of those scum. All I know is getting through this checkpoint isn't going to be easy. What say we join forces? Teaming up with the Shogun's men wasn't part of the plan. But we've got no choice. With swordsmen of your caliber, we'll make short work of them. <laughs> You're quite some fighter yourself, Ksaka. So, Kondo sent you, did he? Well, fear not. I'll head back after a few more games. What? You joined the Roshigumi? Well, no matter. I'm more interested in mixing with the grinder. Take his cutter here. A fine fellow indeed. Not so fast. It's my lucky day. I'm telling you. I'm going to win so big, that Thor will seem like a pittance. What? You would have me join the forces with the Shogunate? I'm honored, flattered even, that you consider me so open-minded. Hey, Takasugi. How about we make a little wager? You and I have ambitions to change the world. Right? Well, why don't we see which one of us Lady Luck favors? You want to see which one of us is born luckier? Sounds like fun. I accept. <laughs> no hard feelings if you're taken for all you got. Yeah? Down goes the cup! Folks, come, place your bets. You finished? Then betting is closed. The numbers are... Five and four, odd! Gah! 
Damn it all! Next game! In go the dice! Folks, come, press your bets. You finished? Then betting is closed. The numbers are... One and two. Odd. Yeah! <sighs> Next game. Another win for them. How curious. <sighs> Not my day. Down goes the cup. Folks, come, press your bets. You finished? Then betting is closed. The numbers are... Five and two. Odd. Gah! Damn it all! Next game. So that's the way of it. You noticed too, yes? <laughs> that explains it. In go the dice! Folks, come, press your bets! Huh? Stop with your ridiculous lies! Some nerve you've got. Don't think I'll let you off so easy. There's neither luck nor skill at play here. Only trickery. One thing's for sure. Those thugs are going to be looking out for us. Seems like we got no choice but to team up. You're quite the fighter, Ishigata. Too good to languish in Roshigumi. That's for sure. <laughs> You're not such a bad fighter yourself, you know. All right. Any ideas for how we should strike? My men are very rough and ready, so I'll order them to attack head-on. Objections? If you're striking from the front, we'll sneak around the back and launch a surprise attack. It's probably best we don't all fight shoulder to shoulder. Very well. It's not like we completely trust your men either. You can join forces with whomever you choose. You and Katsura go back a fair way, after all. Now, what do you say we take the fight to those ruffians? Good. Only don't get too cocky. No. Who do you plan on joining? Happy to hear it. We'll be counting on you. Are you trying to die? There's only so much I can do. Well, this is proving to be a pain. Can't let you keep getting banged up for me, Iwata. That's just embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh! <laughs> 
Well done out there. Fighting for the Choshu brings out the best in you. No doubt about it. Yeah. You may be a bunch of mutinous rebels, but you know how to fight. I'll give you that. And there I was thinking your men were nothing but toadies and halfwits. But they too have potential, I concede. Hmm. Listen, now that we dealt with those gangsters, shall we set our differences aside and celebrate? Sounds like a plan. For now, let's drink and make merry. Hmm. You'll be joining us, I take it? No, it seems he's heading to Kyoto on his own. Guess he's running late for something. <laughs> mm. You most certainly have. A manly drinking contest. Oh. <coughs> if you insist, my dear. You are a lovable one, aren't you? Oh, you can really drink, can't you? Don't be shy. Drink, drink. Hey, huh? what's an expulsionist doing with the beer? We'll expel the foreigners, but their drinks can remain. Kampai! Kampai. Don't forget me. Kampai! Looks like I'm up next. Give us a good one. All right. Well, I'd have expected your Roshigumi to be here by now. Patience. You're too anxious. The Roshigumi are on their way to Kyoto, I assure you. What happens next is anyone's guess. Nothing. We both know your real goal is to weaken the Shogunate from within. Perhaps. But what to do with all those fine warriors? Their skills could be useful. In a number of ways. In any case, it depends on the course you decide to take. We await a favorable response. The culture this nation still calls its own is worthy of admiration. If only I could say the same for all of its people. A real shame. Shigumi ahead of him offering their protection. The Shogun, Yoshinobu Tokugawa, safely arrives in Kyoto. However, the capital is a hotbed of insurrection, as rival samurai jostle for position and pursue their respective goals. Sir, there are some awful rumors going around. They're saying Hachiro's been killed, and he was secretly involved with the anti-shogunate faction. I am sorry to say, but it's all true. His body was found in the city last night. No! 
He's dead? It can't be. There was a message to the Kyoto rebels in his pocket. He was trying to sell the Roshigumi services to the highest bidder. Hachiro, of all people, with the anti-shogunate bunch. That snake. Do we know who took him out? Not yet. Which makes me think, whoever was helping Kyokawa communicate with the other side could in fact be a member of our outfit. Now that I recall, wasn't it Kyokawa who brought you both into the Roshigumi? Right. Come on, Kondo. You don't really think we're traitors, do you? Sorry, I, I shouldn't have doubted you. Look, I'm just a little thrown by everything. Look, Kondo is not the only one to have started questioning his comrades' loyalties. Everyone's getting a bit jumpy, as I feared they would. If we stay in Kyoto, this could very well tear us apart. Which is why the Shogun has ordered us back to Edo. Right now? I can't get on board with sudden orders like that. The rebels have infiltrated us, and you want us to leave as if nothing's happened. Shouldn't it be our top priority to protect His Excellency while he's in Kyoto? No. We would only be putting his life in danger. Imagine letting a traitor get close to the Shogun. The shame that would bring. I'll summon the entire outfit before long. In the meantime, try to calm yourself. You each need to have a good think about a proper course of action. It's hard to believe Hachiro is gone. What are we supposed to do now? Well, to begin with, I guess we should see what everyone's thinking. Everyone will have their own opinion, but you must understand. As much as it pains me, I cannot disobey the Shogunate. We meet again. I've heard. Well, if there's work to be done in Edo, then that's fine by me. It doesn't matter where I am, as long as I can hone my skills, that is. We finally get to talk. My name is Shinpachi Nagakura. I can't quite explain it, but you won't go wrong following Kondo. Met before. We worked together. Or did you forget that? <laughs> it doesn't matter. I know someday my reputation will precede me. So much so that I've practically moved into his dojo. There aren't many men capable of making full use of my strength. Later then. The name's Todo, and you'd best not forget it. It's a shame about Kyokawa, but I'm sure that Master Kondo will make a fine leader. Likewise, I never got the chance to fight alongside you at Ejiri Post, but perhaps we would rely on each other's blade in the future. Indeed, I may yet be a greenhorn, uh, but I've gotten him to notice me. How are you doing? Where Kondo goes, we follow. It's as simple as that. So you came. We've come all the way here, 
We can't turn tail now. Return to Edo if you like, but we're going to stay and get new orders. There's a lot to chew on. But we need to decide what our next steps will be. Katsu asked us to investigate what was going on inside the Roshigumi. If they dissolve it, we're out of a job. And Kondo's on a new mission, taking action with the volunteers. If that's the case, I think we have two options. Either we work together with Kondo's group, or we take this as our cue to leave. I don't really know which is the right thing to do. But we have to make a choice. Hmm. If we parted ways with Kondo, we could ferret out what they're up to. We wouldn't have to answer to anyone, but we'd be on our own. Maybe we should just side with the anti-Shogunate faction. For better or for worse, Katsura and the others would be our allies. We'll have to make sure the troops left in Kyoto behave themselves, while trying to root out any anti-Shogunate saboteurs. And if Katsura and his men do try to take a shot at the Shogun, we'll have a fight on our hands. Yes. I think that's probably for the best. Katsu's main concern is harm befalling the Shogun, after all. The thing is, we're not really part of either faction. I know that whichever path we choose, we'll be doing it for Japan's future. Is anyone else going to show? Huh? Looks like everyone's here. going to negotiate directly with Lord Katamori to offer our services in Kyoto. All who have the guts, follow me! Shogun arrived in Kyoto. The city has been in constant turmoil. So I find your proposed army a most intriguing idea. Very well. They shall keep the peace in the city. And from now on, let them be known as the Shinzengumi. I'm just glad Lord Katamori continues to have faith in us. I'll reassemble the outfit, with Toshi as my second in command. I hope I can still count on your support. By our deeds, our name will ring out over Kyoto. And the Shogunate will have to grant us the status we will have earned. Lord Katamori is sending us on a raid close to Kamogawa. We'll head there immediately. Very good. Well, in behind me. The General Commander and the rest have already gone ahead. 
Ijikata's group will likely join us later on. With all of us together, no one can stand up to our might. I'm expecting you to play your part as well. The Choshu have brought the anti-shogunate forces together at the Ikeda Inn in order to plan their uprising. Some of the men inside might have helped us with those checkpoint thugs. But if they insist on their cause, we have no choice but to take them out. On top of that, reports say Tezo Mihabe is among their numbers. He is as important to their movement as Shoin Yoshida was. Yes. I heard about the plot from Lord Katamori himself. He was a seditious criminal who threatened the peace His Excellency secured. We cannot allow another man to take his place. Indeed. Letting even one get away could cause a world of trouble. Let's play this by the book. We should sure have the lesser numbers. Shall we wait for Hijikata's detachment? We must not arouse suspicion by waiting around. We make our move now. Understood? Let's go get them! Indeed. I'm itching to draw my blade. This marks the first great battle of the Shinsenkumi. Go forth. Seems I have no choice but to fight! Oh. Oh. So you here too? Please, come back to us. Seems I'm outmatched. Are you ready, Katra? to have a familiar face like you and make them spill the beans. Very well. I'll be back as soon as I've got Soji out of here. Just don't let your guard down. <coughs> Damn it! I'm sorry. <sighs> we meet again, perhaps for the final time. Please, give me a chance to speak. So... Have you truly turned your back on us? That was... honest. You're made of sturdier stuff than I thought. As a fellow samurai, we are a dying breed. I am prepared for what comes next. However, I must ask that you look after Kusaka and the rest once I am gone. Your word is good enough for me. I trust you to keep it. I have one last trick up my sleeve. If I'm going to the grave, I'll take them all with me. Run, Katsura. I leave the rest to you. Yes, sir. Godspeed, Master Miyabe! Katsura still trusts you, it seems. 
It would be a shame for you to die here too. I bid you flee. Go on. What's a heroin down in there? Wait. What of Miyabe and Katsura? There were rumors he was amassing gunpowder. But I never thought he'd turn it on himself like that. Well, look for any injured men and patch them up for me. Seems like it. I saw them a moment ago. Well... We didn't manage to finish them off. But we certainly nailed some heavy hitters. I'm chalking this one up as a victory. We'll withdraw after we've attended to the wounded. Nakaoka! You did well to make it such a long way. The days of the Shogunate are over, Kusaka. It's been a pleasure fighting alongside you. Nah. Choshu troops are in the mountains ready for battle. I pull some strings and have a sizable army under my command now. If my Kihetai join you, the Shogunate doesn't stand a chance. You know it! <laughs> Kusaka, we have the advantage. Just say the word, and your troops... We'll be ready to march! Great. No sign of Katsura? He was attacked by the Shinsengumi at the Ikeda Inn. He managed to get away, it seems. But we are not sure where he is now. I see. In that case, do you remain firm in your resolve? Yes. Your troops have come a long way and given us a golden opportunity. It is time to live up to Master Shoen's ideals. When I fled my clan in Tosa, it was your clan that took me in. It's time for me to repay the favor. Oh. <laughs> Will you let bygones be bygones, and fight the Choshu alongside me? I am not sure the Satsuma clan will be all that useful on the unfamiliar terrain of Kyoto. I assure you that is not the case. Your forerunner, Lord Shimazu, possessed foresight. He traded with Britain for the latest weaponry, and prepared for this day. He demanded that the Shogunate embrace reform. Hmm. Truly, he was a loyal servant of the Shogun, an example to all. If the Satsuma clan remain bonded closely with me, we can realize the ideals of your predecessor. You think the same, don't you? Good to see you. I was just about to begin drilling the troops. Kondo has given me command of the Shinsengumi's first unit. I was planning on doing some one-on-one -on -one practice with the men. The recent arrest at the Ikeda Inn left a lot to be desired, after all. Perhaps you could join the training, if you can spare the time. I think facing you would provide fine experience for the men. My thanks. 
Then let's get straight to it. First unit, we will now commence sparring practice. Be sure to give it your all. Didn't stand a chance. Call yourself a member of the first unit? No wonder. Even Okita vouches for you. Swing with your body, not your arms. I may be new, but I'll fight to win. Ready when you are. Thanks for your help with the training. How did you think it went? Yes, your sword play is as fascinating as ever. I was glad to only be spectating this time, instead of facing it head on. Apologies for not introducing myself. My name is Rintaro Inoue. Allow me one question, that I might improve my study of the sword. You are extremely talented. I can tell. But what is it that motivates you to draw your sword day after day? Ah! I do the same! I have a wife and two children. And Kyoto has become dangerous of late. I joined the Shinzen Gumi to keep my family safe. Right then, I better get back to training. Fighting for those one holds dear. Reminds me of my days in the dojo at Edo. I wanted nothing more than Kondo's praise and Hijikata's respect. That's why I wielded my sword. Having people to live up to makes a person stronger. Do you have someone like that? Soji Okita, I presume. I have come to avenge Master Miyabe. He's no ordinary warrior. Stay back! All of you! The two of us will deal with him. When 
I'm done with you, I'll do the rest. It's Okita that I want. Don't get in my way. I will withdraw for now. But know this. I'll hunt down each and every member of the Shinsengumi. Like the dogs you are. Thank you for your help. <coughs> <clears throat> Apologies. Don't worry. It's nothing I can't handle. Look, there's no cause for concern. Just forget about it, please. What the hell is going on here, Soji? I heard the first unit was draining, but... I believe that was Gensai Kawakami. He said he was avenging Tezo Miyabin. I'd heard whispers of anti-shogunate assassins. Still, I'm glad you're unharmed. We have plenty of enemies. But the future is bright, as long as you're with us. That move you did just now was incredible, sir! I could never have pulled it off without you by my side. But... It's nice to be looked up to now and then. With great help from our friend here, we were able to complete our previous mission. Fine work. You may stay a while longer. Things may have worked out advantageously at Ikeda Inn, but since then, the Choshu have been making a most disquieting show of things. <sighs> If they raise an army and strike, it'll be all-out war. The Shinsengumi must act now. I expect results from you. Are you prepared to raise your sword against Choshu? Well said. Then be at the ready. Joshua, they're here. We need you to enter from the northern gate and locate Kusaka, the commander of their main force. You'll almost certainly be part of the vanguard. When you find him, show him no mercy. The traitors who dare threaten the palace will die by our hand. <laughs> 